subscribe to this channel and press the bell icon to stay updated with latest tips and tricks. Recently I made a video in which I showed the installation guide of Android Oreo on Mi A1 without the custom recovery. Now is the time for the review of the same. I recommend you to watch this video till the end and let's get started. Let's begin with the dialer pad. If you swipe left or right, you will see a small pink slider at the top. And when you make a call to someone, it will display a bluish transparent dialer pad, which is the new update from Google. When you open a browser, play any video, press the home button and it will take you to the picture in picture mode. This helps you to play any video while multitasking. This is just amazing. From the top, if you slide down, you will find the quick toggles followed by notifications. And you will see a new animation in the notifications. This is just amazing. If you further slide down, you will find a whitish notification panel which is fully customizable. Now let's go to settings. Here you will find the complete white settings. Coming to battery performance, it is same as that of Android Nougat and I didn't face any issues with the battery performance. Here you can turn on or off the battery percentage which was not available in Android Nougat. If you go to display, here you can turn on or off the adaptive brightness and in advance, you can turn on or off the ambient display. Now at the bottom, you don't find about phone section. Instead, you will find system. Go to system. At the bottom, you will find the about phone. Just click on that. Now tap on Android version for a few times. It will activate the Android Oreo Easter egg. If you long press it, it will activate the Android Octopus. So this was the quick overview of the Android Oreo on Mi A1. That's it about this video guys, I hope you guys have enjoyed this video and if you did, make sure to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to this channel for more videos like this.